Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to debunk a common myth about sexual health. Does peeing after ejaculation kill sperm or prevent pregnancy? This misconception has been around for a long time, and we're here to set the record straight with some key facts and engaging stories. So, grab a seat and let's dive into this topic with a mix of science, history, and a bit of storytelling. Welcome to Health Explorer. Here, we delve into a wide range of health-related topics, from understanding various diseases to discovering effective natural remedies whenever possible. Our mission is to provide you with reliable, accurate information sourced from reputable websites and the latest scientific research. We explore the effectiveness of modern treatments and discuss their real-world applications and potential complications. By joining us, you'll gain valuable insights into health, wellness, and disease management. Don't forget to like our videos, subscribe to our channel, and hit the bell icon to stay updated with our latest content. Let's embark on this journey towards better health and knowledge together. The Myth First, let's talk about the myth itself. Many people believe that urinating after sex can wash away or kill sperm, thus preventing pregnancy. This idea probably stems from the fact that urinating after sex is recommended to prevent urinary tract infections UTIs. However, these two concepts are entirely different. Urination does not affect sperm already inside the reproductive tract. The journey of sperm. To understand why peeing after ejaculation doesn't affect sperm, we need to know a bit about how the female reproductive system works. When a man ejaculates, millions of sperm are released into the vagina. These sperm are incredibly fast swimmers. In fact, they can reach the fallopian tubes within minutes. Example story. Imagine a group of marathon runners at the starting line. As soon as the gun goes off, they sprint towards the finish line. Similarly, sperms are like marathon runners, immediately racing through the cervix and into the uterus after ejaculation. By the time a woman gets up to urinate, those sperm are already well on their way. Historical Perspective Throughout history, various cultures have had different beliefs about conception and pregnancy prevention. In ancient Greece, for example, some believed that jumping up and down after sex or even sneezing could prevent pregnancy. In medieval Europe, women were advised to hold their breath and perform specific rituals. These methods, of course, were based on myths and lacked scientific backing. The science behind it. Let's delve into the science. Urinating after sex doesn't affect the sperm already in the reproductive tract. Once sperm enters the vagina, it quickly travels through the cervix and into the uterus. Urine passes through the urethra, which is separate from the vagina, meaning it cannot reach the sperm. Scientific Insight According to a study published in the Journal of Sexual Medicine, sperm can survive in the female reproductive tract for up to five days. This ensures that there is ample time for fertilization if an egg is present, regardless of urination. The Anatomy Lesson To further illustrate, let's take a closer look at the anatomy involved. The urethra and the vagina are separate structures. When you urinate, the urine exits through the urethra, which does not intersect with the vaginal canal where sperm travel. This fundamental anatomical fact makes it clear why urinating after sex cannot affect sperm inside the vagina or uterus. Preventing Pregnancy – Effective Methods While peeing after sex doesn't prevent pregnancy, there are effective methods to do so. Contraception is the most reliable way to prevent pregnancy. Let's talk about some of these methods. Number 1. Condoms. Not only do they prevent pregnancy, but they also protect against sexually transmitted infections STIs. Number 2. Birth control pills. These regulate hormones to prevent ovulation. Number 3. IU, D intrauterine devices. These are placed inside the uterus to prevent sperm from fertilizing an egg. Example story. Take Jane, who thought urinating after sex was enough to prevent pregnancy. She was shocked to learn about its ineffectiveness and decided to consult her doctor. Now, she uses an IUD and feels much more secure about her contraception. Peeing after sex. The real benefits. While it doesn't prevent pregnancy, peeing after sex is still important, especially for women. It helps flush out any bacteria that may have been introduced during intercourse reducing the risk of UTIs. So, it's a good practice, but for reasons unrelated to conception. Historical Insight 
The recommendation for women to urinate after sex to prevent UTIs has been around for decades. Medical advice from the early 20th century highlighted the importance of this practice to maintain urinary health. Common Misconceptions There are many misconceptions about sexual health that we encounter. For example, some people believe that certain sexual positions can prevent pregnancy or that douching after sex can eliminate the risk. These methods are ineffective and can sometimes even be harmful. Historical Insight In the early 20th century, Douching with substances like Lysol was marketed as a contraceptive method. This was not only ineffective, but also dangerous, leading to health complications for many women. Let's take a moment to engage with you, our audience. Have you heard any other myths about pregnancy prevention? What were you taught growing up about sexual health? Share your thoughts and experiences in the comments below. Your stories can help others who might have similar questions or misconceptions. Understanding sexual health is crucial for making informed decisions. Myths and misconceptions can lead to unintended consequences, so always seek out accurate information. If you have any more questions or topics you'd like us to cover, let us know in the comments. We're here to help you navigate through these important aspects of life. Scientific Insight Let's delve a bit deeper into the science. A study by the American Pregnancy Association indicates that sperm are exceptionally resilient. Once ejaculated, sperm can survive in the female reproductive tract for up to five days. This resilience ensures that sperm have a higher chance of meeting an egg, even days after intercourse. Real Life Scenario Consider a couple who relies on myths for contraception. Sarah and Tom believed that peeing after sex was an effective birth control method. They were shocked when Sarah became pregnant. This scenario underscores the importance of understanding and using reliable contraceptive methods. How do you ensure that you're using reliable contraception methods? Have you ever fallen for a sexual health myth? Share your stories in the comments below. Your experiences can help educate and inform others. Historical Context Throughout history, there have been numerous myths and misconceptions about pregnancy prevention. In ancient Egypt, Women used a mixture of crocodile dung and honey as a form of contraception. While this might sound bizarre today, it highlights how far we've come in understanding sexual health. Modern Day Practices Today, we have access to a wide range of contraceptive options. From hormonal methods like birth control pills to long-term solutions like IUD, there's something to fit everyone's needs. It's essential to consult with healthcare professionals to find the best method for you. The Role of Education Education plays a critical role in dispelling myths and promoting healthy sexual practices. Comprehensive sex education programs teach about contraception, STI, prevention, and healthy relationships. These programs equip individuals with the knowledge they need to make informed decisions. Before we wrap up, I want to encourage you to have open and honest conversations about sexual health with your partners and healthcare providers. It's important to dispel myths and ensure everyone has access to accurate information. What steps do you take to stay informed about sexual health? Do you feel comfortable discussing these topics with your partner or healthcare provider? Let's continue the conversation in the comments. Conclusion In conclusion, the idea that peeing after ejaculation kills sperm or prevents pregnancy is a myth. Urination after sex does not affect the sperm already in the reproductive tract. To effectively prevent pregnancy, use reliable contraception methods like condoms, birth control pills, or IUD. Remember, maintaining good sexual health practices is essential, and it's always best to consult with healthcare professionals for personalized advice. Thanks for watching. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like, subscribe, and share it with others who might benefit. See you next time, and stay informed and healthy.